Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to set Windows to restart, shut down, log off, etc. at a certain time on your Windows computer. So this is going to be a free utility I'm going to be showing you guys in this tutorial. And there are several of these on the internet, but I just wanted to highlight one that I particularly thought was interesting and just wanted to give you guys a demonstration of that today. So we're going to open up a link I'm going to have in the description of the video to this Windows Report website and it should basically be pretty self-explanatory here. There's going to be a green download button right here in the top right. Just go ahead and left click on that. And it should be downloaded as a zip file. So just open up that compressed folder. I'm going to minimize out of the web browser. should be an application file in here. Just go ahead and double click on that. Select the Run option. Select Run. If you need to install that framework, which was one of the requirements on the website, we're going to go ahead and select download and install this feature. So it should only take a couple moments here. Please be patient. Okay, so once that's done, we're going to select close. And if we attempt to relaunch the application here, there you go. So you can move that file somewhere on your desktop. You want to put it in a documents folder or maybe a USB flash drive, whatever you want. And basically, once you have it open here, it says choose when. You just set the date in which you want to make the action. So you could set the date in here. You could open up the calendar view as well to the exact time down to the second and choose what action type you can set lock computer, log off, sleep, hibernate, reboot, shut down, or power off. And then if you want to start the timer or stop the timer as well, so if you wanted to have a specific delay, so you could set the delay tab here instead of doing a fixed date. So if you want to set it down so many hours, minutes, or seconds, you can right there. And you can also do it immediately, which will start the timer or stop the timer. So if it's set for the current time, it's just going to do it immediately. So let's just say we want to do a 10 second delay here just for the demonstration of this tutorial. So I'm going to use the delay tab, set it for 10 seconds, and then I'm going to select start timer. 
So in eight seconds the system will shut down. So just make sure you have any open programs or applications closed out before you go ahead and initiate this tool because it will shut down the system as you can see. The action type is set to shut down in the moment and the system is shutting down. So pretty straightforward tutorial here guys. I hope I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.